Hey guys, first and foremost, before we even get started on today's review, allow me to personally wish each and every one of you a safe and happy Memorial Day weekend as it has finally arrived. I'm sure you guys were all like me, couldn't wait to get this weekend kick started. Now, with all that said, it has been crazy busy here at the Brandon No D household. Therefore, I was unable to post you guys a Tuesday and even a Friday video. Apologies. Uh, we're going to try to get two out this weekend, but I also have to set up our pool. We're changing out the liner, and that is some work to be done. That being said, allow me to formally introduce myself to the ones that have never met me before. My name is Brandon No D. That's right. There's absolutely no D in this name, and I strive to bring you guys the latest and greatest tech out there. So if any of that seems to spark the interest, I encourage you, hit my subscribe button. Take that first step. Hit the bell. Hit all to be notified in all the videos I provide, and I will make a promise to you to deliver good, quality, and honest reviews, because that is how I like to roll. Oh, I don't know about you non-coffee drinkers, but you're missing out. I have been jonesing to get my butt back in the studio to create content for you guys. Let's not do that again, okay? Let's try to keep up with the videos. I am still getting companies every day reaching out to the channel to do reviews for you. Very overwhelming, but very blessed nonetheless. All right, guys, let's get on with today's review. And we are covering the Eufy, that's right, the E is silent, by Anchor. It is a 1080p grade resolution doorbell camera. And uh, when they reached out to me and asked me if I'd be interested, of course, you can never get enough cameras, as I've said in the past. So when I received this two weeks ago, I immediately installed it and have been using it ever since so I can give you guys the honest review you deserve. So let's go ahead and dive in and show you everything that comes in the box. All right, right off the bat, you're gonna get this Eufy Quick Start Guide and it's kind of funny they say quick start, but yet it's more of a booklet style. But uh, fear none, I'm gonna show you everything you need to learn about this product. You're also going to get this little pamphlet here that uh, can get you in touch with their support line if you guys have any issues whatsoever. And they also give you a 24 seven monitoring sticker that you can put in the window to let people know that you're secure. Personally, I don't ever like to let anybody know what equipment I'm using, so. Also coming in the box is your micro USB. That's right, guys. Unfortunately, it is a micro USB. <sighs> Uh, I don't know what else to say. It's a micro USB. You'll also get a template and the screws and anchors to mount your system, but obviously I used neither. Now there's also two brackets it comes with, but right now I only have the one. It's a angled bracket and that is to angle the unit 
uh, more towards a certain view that you may find you need. And then obviously the other bracket is mounted where my doorbell is and we'll get to that in just a little bit. All right, let's go ahead and talk about the doorbell chime itself. It's got these antennas that you can flip out, which will give you the range you're gonna need for wherever you place your doorbell camera. On the back of the unit, you're gonna see it's already equipped with a European plug. But for us Americans, we have the household plug that just fits on here, locks in, turns tight, and there you have a regular plug. Looking over to the right side, you have a reset button, and then on the top, you have your sync button. I will show you how that works in just a second. And then you also have your micro SD card slot. Now it will go up to 128 gigs, and that's what I chose to get. And I will definitely leave that link down in the description for you guys to pick one up. So the brass bars is going to go towards the plug. Just remember that when you're pushing it in. And keep this in mind, make sure to get a micro SD card installed before you go and sync this because it will notify you all day long, but nothing will be recorded. And that's very important. So just a little heads up for you. All right, we'll go ahead and set that aside and let's go ahead and take a closer look at the doorbell camera itself. Now, obviously this one came in black, but they do come in white as well. So don't worry, you guys can get something nice to match whatever your decor is. There is the camera. You have your doorbell, which if we push it, it'll already make the sound. Very cool. And <laughs> the dog always goes crazy when I do that. She thinks somebody's at the door. Uh, turning it on the back, here's your waterproof cover. You can pop that open. And yes, folks, that's where the micro USB plug goes. I know, I know. But nevertheless, we're going to go over the specs real soon. And you're going to find out you're not going to be plugging this in very often. And then you have the sync button that you're going to use to sync this to the doorbell chime. So let's go ahead and nerd out with Brandon real quickly. I'll go over the specs. We'll go ahead and show you how this is installed. I'll show you some footage and we'll get you guys out of here. It's Memorial Day weekend, right? Got to get you guys out of here. All right, guys, flipping the box over, you're going to get a crystal clear full HD image, which is 1600 by 1200. They're also saying see more, which uh, Eufy security video doorbell uses a 4.3 aspect ratio to offer a bigger view. You're also getting an IP65 weatherproofing, which is an assurance that the unit will be fine out in the cold, in the rain, if it ends up getting splashed. Here's where I was talking about not worrying so much about the micro USB charge. You get a 120 day battery life. So in other words, on a full charge, it's going to give you 120 days. So you're not going to be charging this as much as you thought. Uh, it has human detection, reduces false alerts like of animals and dogs and things like that. You also have who's there, which will receive facial snapshots, notifications, so you can quickly check. I thought that was pretty cool. They actually send you a thumbnail of the person's face. Pretty sweet. You can also connect this to Google or Amazon and ask it to show you the front door or wherever you have it placed. Pretty cool. And you also get a gold stamp right on the front of the box saying, free, meaning no monthly fees. That is something that Eufy has prided themselves in. And I think it's great because a lot of people don't like that monthly fee. All right, guys, let's go ahead and show you how to connect this system up. Pretty easy. Now, right off the bat, you're going to download the Eufy security uh, for either Android or iOS. And once you get that, you're going to be greeted with this right here that says add device. So we're gonna go ahead and hit add device. And obviously we have the Wi-Fi doorbell chime. We're gonna click on that. All right, and there it is. It says it is recommended to install the device between the router and the doorbell to ensure the best connection, obviously. Okay, we'll go ahead and hit next. Now it says to install the power pin into the chime body as pictured. Here we go, two seconds. Wi-Fi doorbell chime is ready for setup. Now it's gonna find it and hit done. And then next. Wi-Fi doorbell chime was added successfully. And now it wants us to give it a nickname. So we'll go ahead and say brands. Uh, ding dong. Done. All right, so I guess it's brands ding dong. <laughs> Dump it. All right, so it's added successfully. We'll hit next. Your device has solid Wi-Fi connection, got it, so we're done. Now we get to add the doorbell, guys. Here we go, add doorbell. And again, it's gonna be a scan. 
Boop, there it is. It says press sync button for two seconds. We'll go ahead and press that sync button for two seconds. There it is, get the beep, and we hit next. Ready to add device. Here we go, ready to add the device. Whoa, that's making some really cool stuff. All right, looks like we're connected. Wi-Fi doorbell chime is emitting sound wave device to Discover Doorbell. Nice. And now it's gonna go over this continue to detailed instructions, which is pretty cool. It'll tell you how to go ahead and set up your whole device. And I'm not gonna go through all that with you guys right now. Let's go ahead and install this and then I'll show you how the app works. Let's go. All right, here we are outside now. I've obviously went ahead and mounted the bracket that holds the doorbell ring camera. Uh, let me show you that real quick. So that is it right there. I actually mounted it where the doorbell was and just covered up the wiring. Now you'll notice that on the Eufy, it has this little bracket here and there's a pin that you push in and that's what releases it. So it kind of secures it so nobody will run off with it. That's kind of nice. So what we do is put it in at the top first and then push down and it locks right in. And there you go. All right, let's go ahead and show you a few of the settings that you're gonna get with the app. Uh, you can turn camera on or off. Uh, status light lets you know that it's being recorded. That's that light around the doorbell part. Uh, you have a logo watermark. I'm gonna turn that off. I don't like the, the watermark on there. Now we'll go ahead and go into a motion detection. So that is setting up how sensitive you want it to uh, go off, whether it's uh, five being high or one being the lowest. Uh, human only or all motions, I go with human only. And uh, that way you're not picking up animals and things like that. You really want the uh, humans that come up to the door uh, to be recorded. Um, I'm not gonna go through every option on this. Guys, we'd be here till eternity. Uh, but let me tell you, it is packed full. So I'm just gonna go over a few of the important ones and that'll get you on your way. So here's one of the cool features about the Eufy is the thumbnail that I talked about. Now, when you click on these thumbnails, they're easy to detect of who's who, such as Dawn, my mail courier. Sorry, Dawn, if this uh, offends you, me showing a example. But there she is delivering my mail, what she does every day. Uh, here is Prime delivering me a package right here. Yeah, I get a lot of deliveries, sorry guys. But yeah, it's great. That's the nice part about a doorbell ring. Camera is you're able to capture people coming right up to the door. Now here's my daughter coming home. Uh, not sure about the fit. And don't worry, I won't leave myself out. Here I am coming home from work. checking my mail. Uh, here is a night motion. Uh, it looks like it picked up a car driving by, but uh, there it is what it looks like at night. All right, guys, let's go ahead and close this video up as I've got to get outside and get my butt to work as my wife is already outside working on the yard. So uh, pros and cons. Mm, I would say pros is no monthly fee. Very nice. 120 day battery life. Very nice. Wireless. And what that means is you guys are going to be able to put this wherever you want, which is nice. You can put it on an office door. You can put it on a house door. You can put it on a garage. You can put it wherever you want to be able to record somebody coming up and ringing a doorbell. That's the nice part about wireless. Now, of course, they have a wired version as well. And personally, I think that would have been fine for me and where I have mine set up because there was wires exposed there to actually wire in a doorbell. But for the ones that want to be able to just slap that thing wherever you want, this is the system you're going to want to get. Uh, cons. The only cons I would have to say is sticking that pin in the bottom and trying to get it to release where you have to, another con, plug this in when it does run out. Uh, it's not terrible because like I said, it's got 120 days, so that's more than enough, but there is gonna be that downtime overnight, obviously, to give it a full charge. So keep in mind, you will not be recording with this uh, while it's down and being charged. So that's probably my biggest con. Other than that, guys, would I recommend this to you? Uh, although I am not sponsored or endorsed through the company of Eufy or Anchor, 
They merely send the product to me to do you guys the review and it's that simple. Would I recommend it? Of course I would recommend it. Now I'll be sure to drop you an affiliate link down in my description below and where you can pick one of these up. And right now it is going for $99.99 on Amazon. And uh, I think it's a fair price for uh, a doorbell camera as you've seen many other ones out there that aren't even half as good as this for a lot more money. Guys, if you have any questions on today's review or any questions on any of the tech reviews that I've done in the past, don't be scared. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you think, and I will be sure to get back to you as soon as possible. Let's do the Brannon No D opening up the fort. Shit. I broke it. I hope this isn't how my weekend's gonna go. <sighs> Keep up the good work. You're, you soon will be rewarded financially. Well, I guess that's a positive for sure. I hope so, because I'm financially running out of money. Well guys, do me a favor, share and like this video as it helps my channel grow tremendously. And you guys know, or at least I think you know, I'll be seeing you in my next video.